All right, guys. Today I'm going to show you about the Pro Switcher application um, for iPhone and iPod Touch. It is really cool. Um, if you're familiar with the Palm Pre, you will know that <clears throat> they have card switching applications. Okay, so instead of in the iPhone, you go into an application and then you go back out of it and go to another one and everything that was done in that exits out okay so the cool thing about this is swipe down on my bar at the top sometimes I don't hit it and check this out okay I've got a card view of applications that I have open um, so I can click on one like Safari I opened um, okay so I go into messages okay that's great I can do everything in there um, swipe back down on it and I can go back into contacts okay same thing go back into whatever um, these are just the four that I have open but you can have a number uh, a number of things open um, still have your dock here so if I click on clock and it opens up clock And then I slide uh, <clears throat> down on the taskbar. There it is, added to the other four. Okay, so to get rid of them, if you're familiar with the Palm Pre, all you have to do is swipe it up to get rid of it, or you can click on the little X to get rid of it too. Okay, so it is really cool. Um, <clears throat> it works in conjunction with the Backgrounder application that is also um, included in the download with the Pro Switcher. Okay, so you just kind <clears> of <throat> flick them away to get rid of them and tap once to get into it. You can hold the center button too um, on for a backgrounder and it'll go back out. Um, or you can press the home button, it'll go back to the springboard and I'll open up. Uh, let me open up something else here. I will open up, um, I'll open up notes. Okay. And then I'll hold the home button and there it is there's two of them so I can click the home screen go back and I can open up another application so I'll open up pictures and then uh, you can hold the center button and there you go back to all three and then if I don't want any open just get rid of them all no apps running click the home button and that's it okay guys this is really cool and really simple to get and use um, so you just kind of you're gonna open up Cydia, and uh, I'll tell you how to get this. Okay. What you're gonna do is you're gonna hit search. You're going to type in Pro. Oops. Terrible. Oh. Okay, so type in pro. You can just type in pro, it doesn't really matter, I guess. Um, go down to the P section. And, okay, there you go. Pro switcher. No sources needed directly from the system source okay so you're gonna click on that and it will say it will say for you guys it'll say install up here um, it's going to install pro switcher and it will install backgrounder for you um, so you have both of those applications and once you do that um, Cydia I close Cydia and that will not um, open back up okay so um, what you can do is you can go into your settings, okay? Once you have um, Pro Switcher installed, you're, you're going to go down to Pro Switcher. And the cool thing about this is there's different activation methods. So right now I have to swipe down on here. As you can see, there it is. That's the only one I have open. 
okay you can have double press to your home button uh, quickly press the home button twice short hold the home button um, which for some reason mine is set to so let me try that that's just backgrounder um, okay so you can have your you can shake your device you can double press your device double press the sleep button um, you can have a slide in gesture which is what I have um, no sorry I have uh, status bar and I have swipe down okay I could have swipe left let me try that one the good thing about this guys is that there is no respring needed so it saves you a lot of time okay swipe left there it is um, so going back you have a number of different things here you've got um, <coughs> You've got uh, show icon, so if you wanted to show icon, yes or no. Um, badges, you can zoom into the active card. You have the close button. Um, you can have rounded corners. You can have a springboard card, which you don't really need because you can press the home button to go back to the springboard. Um, you can swipe to close, which was what I have. You can, you can, you know, if you know how when I um, when I go to click on one to open it up. You can have one clicks or you can have two clicks if you want. One's the easiest one to have. Um, you can show the dock on the bottom, dim the background, and have different different um, different backgrounds. So it is really neat. There's a lot of settings for it, um, and uh, it is really cool. So, um, anyways, that's all I want to show you guys. So comment and rate if you think it's good. Um, you know. Let me know if it could have been better or if it, you know, if it was bad, um, whatever you guys think. And um, subscribe if you like the video.